All right, what's going on there, folks? Good evening once again. The Earthmaster jumping in here on this Thursday night once again. Just got through doing an update here on the annular eclipse. Go check it out if you haven't got a chance to check it out. Uh, we do have an earthquake coming in here to the western Indian Antarctica Ridge. Uh, this is down here south of Australia, outside of New Zealand here, off the plate boundary. This area has seen quite a bit of movement here in the past couple days. A 6.0 earthquake coming in right now. Uh, within the last 15 minutes or so, it looks like, from the USGS EMSC, reporting this as a 5.5. Not for sure why, but uh, they have a little bit of a magnitude difference there. Maybe it pumped up a little bit, but USGS has reviewed this, I believe. Has been reviewed. It is an area that does see quite a bit of earthquake activity. Um... And the movement that we've seen down here in the last week or so, let me see if I can bring that up. We did see another earthquake back here uh, just yesterday, a 6.3. So still fairly active in this region. Uh, this is the last seven days, all magnitudes here. Let me go back the last 30 days or so, all magnitudes. Look at this area. Seen a little bit of uptick here across this region. Uh, still makes me want to keep an eye on the New Zealand area it does sit you know obviously away from this plate boundary but the general the uh, general direction out here this divergent boundary type activity is a separation divergent boundary uh, which could increase further strain out here against this plate the Pacific and the Australia plate where New Zealand sits so just keep an eye on that area uh, of New Zealand uh, I didn't get a chance to check them out on my last video Looks like we've seen a handful of earthquakes here since I just posted out this video here. It never fails, right? Um, 3.2 looks like into the area around South Island, New Zealand. Let's double check that here real quick for the GeoNet, from the GeoNet servers and uh, see what we have here real quick. 2.2 an hour ago, 3.2, there's that 3.2 South Island near Arthur's Pass, it looks like. Um, but for the most part right now, we're just seeing generally light earthquake activity across the region. 3.2 is going to be this one right here within the last couple hours. Um, yeah, just stay on guard out there around New Zealand. Uh, looks like this could be, you know, obviously increasing some strain out there. We've seen a lot of unusual activity up here. Uh, Izu Trench, Western Afghanistan, a couple other different areas here recently. And... Uh, just, uh, you know, not to mention that four-pointer that kicked up around around the Hikarangi subduction zone earlier this morning. I still think strain is, strain, uh, is quite high out here against the plate boundary. So be, be safe, you know, keep a, make sure you keep an earthquake plan in the back of your mind there at all times because uh, it, it can be, uh, you know, the difference in um, making it uh, to safety or, you know, unfortunately maybe not making it to safety uh tsunami potential if this thing were to blow as far as the uh, the big one uh, also the alpine fault over here has quite a bit of uh stress built up on it as well so but just keep an eye on that it is uh you know in an area where we should see some movement following this divergent boundary activity have a good one we'll catch you guys back here tomorrow take care